What's up everyone? My name is Shantanu Kweskar and now I am here at the edge of a prime forest and I'm going to take you all with me to observe the smallest sunbird of India which I commonly observe here. The crimson backed sunbird which is actually a smallest bird of South India along with the pale belt flower pecker. It was toughest thing I found to record a selfie video with this little bird as it never sticks to one place for hardly more than 3 to 5 seconds in open. But still I managed it somehow. Let's have a look. Crimson backed sunbird. Crimson backed sunbird or small sunbird, Leptocoma minima, is a sunbird endemic to the Western Ghats mountain ranges of India. It is also the smallest bird found in South India along with the pale billed flower pecker, which also had similar size of 8 cm. The male and female vary in plumage, male having the crimson colors. Upper side of the male has crimson feathers which extends as a breast band to the front side. The throat is metallic purple where his head is shining greenish blue. The colors slightly appear different when watched from different angles and lights. The under parts are yellow in color. The female is mostly yellow with olive green upper parts and crimson rum. Here we can compare the size of these sunbirds, Vigorsus versus the crimson backed sunbird. It is an endemic resident breeder in the western ghats of India. The peak nesting season is December to March, but they are known to nest in nearly all months of the year in the southern western ghats. These birds are important pollinators of some plant species, so their presence is of greater value. Males establish and defend feeding territories on flower bearing shrubs and trees. Being small birds, they may be hunted and eaten by the insects like praying mantises. Although resident in many areas, they may make altitudinal movements in response to rains. In some areas, they move to the foothills during the monsoons and move to the higher regions after the rains. Their main habitats include areas with flowering plants near forests, shola forests and valleys, and they are frequent visitors in gardens and flowering trees near forests only. And as always, I hope you all enjoyed observing through my short documentary film. Feel free to share it with your friends and stay tuned for the next one. Also, if you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel yet, please subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.